For the upper quartile, it's much the same story as the lower quartile, OK? But now, once we've divided it into two sets, we are going to find the median of the upper half. So when we have seven numbers, the median was the 18, OK? So what we do is we ignore the number 18, and now you're finding the median of the second half of the data set. And so the middle number, which in this case is the 23, OK? So the upper quartile is the 23. Now, for an even set of data like this, we're going to do the same thing. The median here was 20, halfway between the 18 and 22. And so we're now trying to find the median of the second half of data. So that is halfway between 23 and 30. Okay. Now, a quick way to um, find the middle number is to add them together and divide by 2 if you're ever unsure. Okay, But 23 to 30 is a 7 difference. Half of 7 is 3.5, and so it would be 26.5. And so that would be your upper quartile.